Okay. Factorio trains are dead simple once you get the hang of them. First of all, let's go through rail signals and chain signals. So, the rule of thumb for rail and chain signals are uh, chain signals go before two tracks merge and normal rail signals go after two tracks merge. So you see I've got the tracks go this way and I've got a chain signal leading into the merge here and here and then after the merge I've got the rail signal. So I have that for this too. I've got the chain signal going into the merge and two rail signals coming out of the merge. So the trains themselves fuel goes in here and for automation uh, I was a little bit confused with this too but I realized that at the Zardath stop it will wait for five seconds before going to the next stop the Stefan Geertig stop then at this stop it will wait 10 seconds before going back to the Zardath stop set it to automatic and that's what it'll do I've got another train down here does basically the same thing set that to automatic too as you can see maybe anyway these rail signals if the two trains come at the same time as you can see there this this train stopped because it saw that this chain signal was red because the train had activated this rail signal so that's what chain signals do they check they check the rail signal in front of it and then copy that signal so if this is red it'll turn this red and this train will stop here and that's about it have fun